Okay then. So I'm going to talk you through Camp and Furnace as our new venue. So we've been open now for about a year in Liverpool and the building itself is a whole city block and uh, unfortunately you can't see it around the building but in our biggest room we have a furnace, it used to be a metal smelting plant and then down the corridor here which is the live music venue we used to have a place called the Blade Factory and it was just literally, it used to make rotor blades so down in there we tend to have all our big club nights and we also do, we've got a the Liverpool Psychedelic Rock Festival's in there, and they have a night that's monthly. So they kind of do lots of progressive rock, your more punk shows, your heavy shows. And then there's another room behind us where we have even bigger club nights for like techno and house. And then for the rest of the time, it's just a normal bar. We just do food in the day, and then we have all our events. And also littered around the venue is loads of Norwegian vintage caravans. And they just stand there and look good, but the idea initially was the people to stay over in the venue. There's a lot of events, mainly music events we do. I mean, it was quite a strange one today. We had a whole vintage wedding fair in. And then we also have cult film festivals. So we had Pulp Fiction on the other day with actors acting out the scenes. So everyone was going around in their suits. Um, another one of the rooms we have is a gallery. So they have exhibitions on there all the time. And then because we're only open recently, we have a lot of people that come in and are probably taken back a bit by the size of the venue. Because when we have our big nights, there's 4,000 like capacity. So they tend to get a bit blown away by that. But then people just come back. And we also have our quiet nights when we just have DJs on in the main lobby. And that just tends to just be a very pleasant but easy evening. And it's good. And it's, you know, it's impressive when you come around for the first time.